Movie theaters are still closed and we still have to be careful going out. So we're all looking for ways to entertain ourselves at home. Portable movie projectors that you can use indoors or out are popular these days. Our consumer technology reporter Jamie Tucker has a look at two of what he says are the best projectors to help you decide if they're worth the money. There's something about watching a movie outdoors. My family has enjoyed social distant movie nights all spring, summer, and fall. And portable projectors are a hot gift idea this year. This is the ViewSonic M1 Plus, and this is the Anchor Nebula 2. They both run on a battery for about two and a half hours, which is very important. You don't want to have to plug these into an outlet when you're outside, and you want to finish the movie. You can plug in a Fire Stick or a Roku, stream Hulu, YouTube TV, Netflix, no wires at all. The Nebula 2 has Android TV built in, so all you have to do is connect your Google account to download the apps. Super easy to use. Both also have inputs for USB-C and HDMI cables, so you can plug in a smartphone, laptop, or tablet. You can also stream the content directly from your phone to the projector. Both are loud enough to hear the movie outside, but you can also connect a Bluetooth speaker to bump up the sound. The ViewSonic is full HD, so the picture is a little better, a little brighter. Here's the movie Elf with the ViewSonic. And now the Nebula. A couple of things you want to pay attention to, battery life and lumens. The higher the lumens, the brighter the picture. You'll pay more for the Nebula too. It's about $580 online, but I've seen it drop to about $400. The ViewSonic M1 Plus is around $260, and it's selling fast. One other tip, get a tripod that allows you to tilt and level these projectors. Uh, outdoor portable screens go from anywhere from $40 to $400, or you could just hang up a bed sheet on a wall. These make great family Christmas gifts that you'll really appreciate the next warm night, whenever that's going to be. That's What the Tech. I'm Jamie Tucker. Some of the most popular projectors and portable movie screens sold out in the early days of the pandemic, but for the most part, they're back in stock at most all retailers carry them.